Hello everyone, this is the SMUF team and I'm about to present you a tutorial on how to create a basic application for Smart TV. More specifically, together we will create a weather application that will run on multiple platforms. And we can achieve that by using SMUF SDK. This is a sneak preview of what our application will look like after we've finished. But, before we get our hands dirty with code, it is important to explain what SMUF is and why it could be useful to you. If you are interested in Smart TV application development, you probably already know that there are quite a few vendors out there. Vendors like Samsung, LG, Android, and even Amazon. And each one of them has its own platform-specific APIs for creating Smart TV apps. Some are based on JavaScript, others on Android. Now, imagine you could write one single application with JavaScript that could be deployed on all the pre-mentioned platforms. That's exactly what SMUF does for you. SMUF is a software development kit created to address the fragmentation in Smart TV application ecosystem and remove the difficulty of creating Smart TV apps that run almost everywhere. Let's move on to the prerequisites for this tutorial. In order to create a Smart TV application with SMUF, you will first need a SMUF account which is completely free and all you need to do is go to page smuff.tv and register. Within this tutorial we will be using SMUF command line tools. They are not absolutely required but they make the development a lot easier and they are also free. Finally, we will need an open weather map account. We will be building an application that displays weather information and that's where we will be getting our data from. SMUF command line tools require that you have Node.js and NPM installed in your machine. You can find detailed instructions on how to install them on any platform at NPM's documentation. You can find the link on the sources provided below the video. Having installed Node and NPM, you simply need to open a terminal or a command prompt and run the following command. Now, if you are on a Linux distribution, you need to run this command as root, which means you'll need to add sudo at the beginning of the command. At this point, we need to wait for a few seconds as npm downloads the necessary parts for SMAF command line tools to install properly. One more thing you need to remember is that you only need to run this command once. Having done so, we can proceed using the tools regardless of the directory where our project lays, since our installation takes place globally. Having finished with the installation, let's move on to the source for our weather data. This first application we will create will display a 5-day weather forecast and as we mentioned earlier, the data for this project will come from Open Weather Map. However, in order to have access to their API, an API key is required. To do that, we need to open a browser and navigate to Open Weather Map dot org slash app id hashtag get we need to find the sign up link and complete the form with our credentials we need to agree to the terms and conditions and select create account we've already done that so on the resulting page we're able to find our api key which is right here we need to save it because we will be using that later on in the tutorial. That's it for now. 
Let's sum up what was presented up to this point. We are going to build a weather app using Smuff SDK that will play on multiple smart TV platforms. We explained what Smuff is and what it stands for. We went through the prerequisites for the tutorial, which were namely a Smuff account, Smuff command line tools, and an open weather map account. On the next tutorial, we will use our tools to write code and develop the weather application. Again, this is the Smuff team. Thanks for watching and hopefully we'll see you in the next tutorial.